have the right amount of backlighting to be able to find some goodies down here. Um, that's awesome. That is so good, guys. You have a few different color options. Um, very nice. Very, very nice. Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to show you all how we can add some lighting to the bottom section of the um, console area here so that at night when we're searching for things we'll be able to find things more easily, especially when there's a bunch of stuff and you're always at night, you know, quite blindly trying to find things. So I'm thinking, um, very simple um, process, I'm going to grab the wiring from the light bulb illumination of the cigarette lighter barrel and tuck that out through the auxiliary hole which is right underneath there you might just be able to see it so uh take you through my process today guys we'll just go through and remove and pop up this center console trim piece here and there's just four clips that just lift up and out and with that removed we can pop that aside then uh we'll have for these side trim pieces here to get removed there are two screws one screw here and the second screw here i've just removed them earlier uh, just for demonstration purposes to speed up the video these after those two screws are removed these side trim pieces come out now if you put your handbrake up this side trim piece just lifts up and out um, once you've got that the two screws here one screw there and the second screw there once you've removed those then this center bin piece comes out now and disconnect the wiring from the back of your cigarette lighter socket you'll usually find this little bulb holder taped up to that wiring adapter plug and um, in this case um, you know once you put a light bulb in there it's a t5 size I've got an LED in here and every time that you go and turn your headlights on you're actually going to get some lighting from that bulb. So what my plan to do <clears throat> today guys is to go through and tuck this wiring plug, uh, I should say this light bulb holder, get that wiring poking out through this bottom hole here. Awesome guys, now that we've got our <clears throat> bulb holder and the wiring pushed through this bottom hole, we can place our LED inside. We'll be able to leave that LED underneath place our bin back back here is firm underneath like that and it's you know protected by by this I mean if you if we're not careful some of our um, items and things will hit this area where your LED is but um, for the time being this will do later on I'll perhaps use something like an LED strip that I've got here um, but that'll be for another video because we can then safely tuck that away but for now every time that we turn our headlights on like so now we've got some great lighting under there and at night that's going to give us a great great vision on, and I'll show you guys <coughs> what this looks like back at night so for now guys let's go through and put our trim pieces back and uh, we can return back at night have a, a lookist for this to go back. Um, you can go through and put your screws back in here and here and with those screws back in we can go and put our trim piece back on again like so and it just pushes straight down. Excellent. So guys let's come back back at night and um, have a look but even during the day, we can already see there's some good lighting. But at night, it's going to make all the difference. So let's come back and, uh, and see what it's all looking like. Okay, guys, and now we're back for the nighttime viewing. Ah, oh, that looks perfect. Let's get this to just give us a, a more accurate lighting, true to life. That is perfect, guys. So, I mean, of course, we've got some bulky things down here, but if it's just some minor things, you know, that's some really good lighting. That is epic. Loving that, and that's on and off with the with the park lights. That's perfect. And guys, this is a bit of a green LED, um, so it will match all the uh, green that we have elsewhere. Now it's quite bright. This is just a single directional LED. But I just wanted to show you that you have a few different color options, 
Um, very nice. Very, very nice. Now, earlier this evening, I went and installed some footwell lighting. Um, and that'll come out in a video in just a couple hours. Beautiful. Look at that. Guys, we're getting some lighting. Later on, I'll be making some cup holder lighting to match down here. But that is perfect, guys. I'm so happy with that. That is awesome. So, guys, thanks for watching. And um, as always, we've got to flick something for luck. So let's flick the, the bottom of this bin area for luck. Beautiful. And it feels lucky already. <laughs> All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. And, um, you know, looking forward to to the next one with you guys seeing what else I've got in store I think it'll probably end up being that cup holder lighting but that is looking epic guys thanks so much catch us next time